So, a 13 year old teen, a sh shot and killed right in the front yard. Like, subscribe, ID in the Discovery Channel. Yes, ID in the Discovery Channel. The links are provided below. Get that Discovery Go app as well as that ID Go app. You might want to get those two things combined and make them into one. And I'm a Discovery influencer. That's indeed a fact. So, 13 year old Brian Zavala was shot and killed after a man wearing a ski mask drove up to where he was doing yard work. He was shot right in the face. Who shoots a 13 year old? Very personal. Who, who, what grown man or woman walks up to a 13 year old and shoots and kills them? He died on the scene, right? His 16 year old brother stated the shooter up let me pause. Let me go back because I want to remember the personal aspect as it not jump over my footing. So his 16 year old brother stated the shooter said nothing. And he, when he exited the vi he basically got out the vehicle, walked up to the 13 year old and just shot him in the face. That's why I said it's, it sounds very, very personal. It indeed dear viewers, he then left. It was indeed a mill, right? He left. No one knows the shooter's identity or where he is. So the story to me sounds off because for the victim to be 13 years old is, is to ask why was he doing yard work at 9 p.m. He was doing yard work before he was shot, but yet who does yard work at 9 p.m.? when it's dark that's a clue in itself it, it in fact is because i don't know anybody anyone grown man or woman that does yard work at 9 p.m possibly 8 p.m if it's still somewhat light outside right the only way i could see something like that is is to say he was doing yard work before and it got dark quick right but you got to think about okay uh, the time frame why was this young child outside at that time do, doing yard work right what, what type of yard work did this involve because that that type of situation should have been committed in a sense uh in the daytime that's not the fault anybody on the end of his family or anything like that but you you have to make wiser choices when it comes to allowing a, a 13 year old of all to be outside like that at that time more so doing yard work because even that could have led to a, a robbery say being right outside of the house or something and somebody sees a child it's an open target right to even do somewhat of a robbery or something pertaining to to housing as in making your way a, a robber up into somebody's house or something like that so the situation is sketchy so i said before it sounds personal right it had to have been someone who knew the family and their intention was to kill the kid to get back at the family it had to have been right uh it's why the killer wore a ski mask i've questioned the company that was kept by the 16 year old of the 13 year old right because he was the one that spoke out right family members any enemies that surrounded the family as in yeah it, it, there's an issue there right whoever killed the 13 year old is and was an enemy to the family it wasn't just a random shooting no you can tell the ski mask wouldn't have been there that's to say they were in fact trying to conceal themselves right so i wear sunglasses because this is my style not everybody has style right somebody might say you look like a, a gangster on camera well i just like all black i do it's outside of the norm i like to do everything outside of the norm right not everybody can take me in black not everybody can take me in shades somebody said that before why do you always have to wear shades why do you wear shades in the in the shower because I like to. I take them off, wash my face, and put them back on. That's just me, right? 
I'm above average and go against the norm, right? Everyone does everything differently, but I'm not going to be wearing no ski mask or anything to kill no 13 year old child or anything. That's crazy, right? There, there's a motive behind why this was done. Because the person could have just got out the vehicle, walked up to him, and shot and killed him with the face exposed. So that's to say whoever shot and killed him, the 13-year-old, must have seen the person's face. You see what I'm going with this? Not everybody would have known that. Well, why do you think uh, it was personal? Because of based off of what I said. If it takes a grown man or woman to wear a ski mask before they kill a 13 year old is to say that that 13 year old had to have been in their presence numerous times as in more on more than one occasion because to know nobody else was outside all like that amongst the 13 year old maybe it was some rivalry rivalry between him to be 13 year old 13 to be a 13 year old is to say sometimes there's words miscommunications between you and another fella or something right 13 years old the only way i can see that is if it's a 15 or 16 year old that was driving a vehicle because even they do that sort of thing as in illegally driving sh driving up to somebody and shooting them over some rivalry or some issue or something like that that's not to say anything gang related or nothing that's not to say that but you know even times like now even 13 14 year old kids are bringing guns and knives and everything to school right so who's to say pertaining to if there was some issue between this 13 year old and somebody else who might have been his age driving a, a vehicle but it was stated that he was male and adult so that's to say that there yeah was the bloodshed had to be enemies pertaining to the family and not just him because I know we have school shootings and all the rest is the question even that well, would it have been a 14 or a 15 year old driving somebody else's car got out and sh shot and killed him could it have been somebody that was 17 18 years old that didn't like him him being 13 and there was an issue or something you see what I'm saying because I'm I'm speaking right in the age time frame or even this kid's older brother who was 16 when i just named 17 to 18 year old the brother what type of enemies could he have had because to be 16 years old as i say even that's somewhere around driving age driving age getting out because to wear a ski mask is to say some people can't really see you possibly wouldn't they they didn't know the identity of the killer but even the killer could have been 16 years old himself driving it's 16 year olds that drive so, so did did the 16 year old fall out with anyone i think that's all to be said uh for that you, you're you're not going to conceal your your identity because that's the ask how many times was the 13 year old around the killer how, how many times uh has the killer been over to the house enough to be in the presence of the 13 year old because did not have killed the 13 year old properly as i say even that 13 year old would have knew just enough say if the shooter would have shot but not killed him and the 13 year old would have still been alive that's to say that that 13 year old would have told law enforcement who that killer was so that killer knew the 13 year old very very well is all i'm trying to say the id logo stands in the far left corner live now deadly recall uh new episodes to receive an audio visual preview you're going to in fact uh click right here you would in fact have access to that unlocked episodes i was gonna say drugs because it seemed like every story that pops up is some drugs at play as in somebody's owing someone 
uh, drug money or something like that. Maybe that could have been the case. Somebody in the family, surrounding the family, could have owed somebody drug money. You never even know. And then they come and they take it out on the young child victim. As Yeah. The child, well, we're going to shoot and kill him because whatever wasn't paid. That The numbers are high with even that sort of thing. You're killing people over money pertaining to drugs. Uh, let me scroll back to so unlock episodes to receive an audio visual preview that's to click the play once again the play button recommended for you shouts out to lieutenant joe kinda as well as paula yeah because I, I don't really like to say drugs in in every uh video but it seems like yeah it seems like this uh an issue nowadays see, seem an american uh drug crisis is where it's at as in the drug usage is so high to receive a newsletter from investigation discovery is a type of email address and a click next and you would in fact receive a newsletter so dear viewers may you enjoy your day i will in fact enjoy mine and i'm gone for now